there, uh, it's Mitch, coming to you from, uh, YouTube.com, and I'm glad to finally be able to make another video, um, <clears throat> it's been pretty tough and challenging to actually be able to make some of these videos, um, due to some of the, like, circumstances and stuff, but, um, I've reached out for some help and stuff, um, like going to some churches and going to meetings and things and actually talking with certain doctors and stuff. <clears throat> and, uh, yeah, I've, I've gained the, the courage to keep doing this, um, despite some of the challenges that I'm facing. Um, so, um, yeah, I mean, the juice thing, um, continuing to do juicing, it is important to me. Sometimes it is a challenge, um, to be honest with you. Uh, but, as far as tonight goes, it's like 12.50 a.m. It's May 30th. Um, so, uh, yeah, I mean, I got another video for you. Um, hope you appreciate these. Um, you know, if you, like, want to see more, um, please subscribe to my videos. Um, some, you know... After talking with some people, and I'm like, I'm not going to say any specific names or anything like that. Um, I'm just going to kind of try to keep to myself as much as I can. Probably. Um, but yeah, sometimes it is a challenge. And, uh, you know, despite those challenges, I like to keep moving forward and continue on with my personal growth and development. And, uh doing these videos and posting them, um, to my channel as part of that, um, but yeah, I'll be honest, there have been some serious challenges lately, um, but I reached out for help, and it wasn't asking for anything other than advice and guidance, and, um, I gained the courage to keep doing this, and, you know, I prayed on it, and I asked for help, and I'm just blessed to be able to keep doing this. And I'm grateful to be alive, seriously. Um, I, I've seen people in a lot worse situations than, than what I'm in. and uh, So, you know, I'm just going to keep moving forward with these um, as much as I can. Um, sometimes I get knocked down, literally and figuratively. Uh, pretty sore right now. Um, so... This juice is going to be kind of like more of a, an alkalizing uh, juice. Um, it's going to be, uh, it's going to have some celery in it. Um, I went to the store, bought some celery stocks. Uh, I've also bought some, what's the buy? Oh, I bought a cucumber, yeah. So it's so I bought celery, cucumber, and then an apple for sweetness. Because the celery is pretty sodium rich, you know, and water rich, um, don't have my glass jar thing anymore, but you know what, that's fine, I can still use the, um, plastic container, um, you know, sometimes I get people that, are, that diss on it or whatever, and people, sometimes people don't like these videos, but you know what, I'm just gonna keep pushing forward, you know, it matters, it, it means something to me, um, whether people like them or don't like them, I'm just gonna keep pushing forward, you know, despite the negativity, I'm going to try to keep it on the up and up, you know, even if, but you know, I'll be honest, I get knocked down sometimes, um, I go through some challenges, um, but you know, I reached out for some support, um, and you know, I got that, and, uh, yeah, I prayed on it, I prayed a lot, actually, I've been praying a lot lately, I've been going to a lot of meetings, and, um, gotta be careful with some of the things I film and post, um, I try to do these on my own, for the most part, uh, due to certain, like, certain legal issues and stuff, and, um, but yeah, I'm good, I'm, uh, gonna keep moving forward, I got this new Juice video for you. it's, uh, May 30th, and, uh, I'm gonna get started, okay? And, uh, let me know if you appreciate these videos. Um, it has been a challenge to keep doing these. Um, 
due to some circumstances. Um, you know, I, I had a good, I had a good few talks, and I found the courage within. I found the courage within myself. I'm like, I'm gonna keep doing it. You know, I'm gonna power through this. You know, producing new content. People might like it. People might not like it. You know what? But I'm gonna keep doing it. I got that courage. I'm gonna harness that. I'm gonna keep power. For, I'm gonna power forward. Um, and on that note, I'm gonna get started right now. Okay. All right. Let's see, five minutes. 30 seconds. Alright, so uh, please give me a thumbs up on this video. Every little bit helps. Um, any kind of support, it doesn't, any, like a thumbs up or a comment or something, like it does keep me motivated um, to keep doing this. Because uh, sometimes it is pretty challenging, uh, to be honest with you. Okay. So, okay, I'll get started right now. Um, so check it out. I'm gonna pull this a little bit forward so you can see. You can see what I'm doing a little bit, a little bit better. Okay. All right. So let's see. You can see. You can see me. It's kind of hard to see. I might need to like, get some light or something. Um. <laughs> so yeah, a, little, a lot of times these videos sometimes it attracts a lot of. The thing is, is uh, a lot of times some of these videos, when I post these online, it attracts attention from people around me in the real world, and like, <clears throat> sometimes that's, uh, dealing with those social issues is sometimes a challenge, uh, so that's one of the things I'm going through, um, but, uh, yeah, I'm gonna keep pushing forward, you know, I mean, it does mean something to me, um, Juicing and, and raw foods is like a like it means something to me, you know. Um, and I'm gonna do my best to keep posting these videos. And uh, it has been a challenge. I'll be honest; it has been quite the challenge to post some of these videos. Sometimes due to power limits. Sometimes due to Wi-Fi limits. Um, location things. Um, but, uh, yeah, I mean, like, I'm not able to access the internet actually right where I'm at, so I'm going to have to go to a different physical location in order to post this. Uh, but, yeah, and I want to be able to put this online, you know, so I mean, I'm willing to go to that link. It's that willingness. I'm, I have the willingness to do it, to do this and keep pushing forward. Um, so, uh, all right, you heard me talking about I guess. But, yeah, you know, any comments, any thumbs up, any posts, it helps. You know, say I'm doing a good job, say I'm not doing a good job, say something, um, let me know, good, bad, something, okay? Um, okay, I'm gonna get started with this one. It's kind of a challenge, lighting is kind of a challenge for me right now. Um, <clears throat> okay, let me see, because I wanted to make, I wanted you to be able to see what I'm doing. See, there's a limit to the cord. <clears throat> okay, yeah, it's hard to kind of hard to see me. Um, see. Yeah, I did a uh, actually I went I did a blood draw yesterday. I went to a hospital. I did a blood draw because I was like kind of concerned about my blood chemistry. And actually, most of it turned out to be okay. I got some paperwork, some lab results, and stuff. Um, tests for certain things, and um, I think I'm doing all right. I'm gonna start something new. <clears throat> okay. Um, I'm trying to see how how um, you can be able to see me and see the thing. I might have to think about lighting. Okay. I'll just try to do it from this angle. <clears throat> okay, so you can see me here. Okay, these are the, um, the produce that I purchased. Okay, so here is uh, some celery. This comes with a. Uh, it's got the uh, metal band around it, so I'm just gonna untie that. So you look at it. Twist it to the right. 
see just to the right a little bit. Comes undone, see like that. I use that for the trash. So I'm gonna put the celery in first because it's like, I've, that's a little trick I've learned to put the celery in first. <clears throat> okay. And then, um, okay, um, and then here's a green apple, um, I'm looking for a sticker on there. Okay, there's no sticker on there, so I look first to see if there's a sticker before removing it. Okay, so I'm going to put this here. Okay, and then, uh, I was looking in the produce section for a cucumber. Here's a cucumber. Um, there's a sticker right here, so I'm going to make sure to remove that. Okay, so let's see, some of it's stuck on there. Okay, I'm going to make sure to pull this part off. Just so, like, you know, glue doesn't get in there and stuff. You know, not don't have to be too OCD about it. Okay, just pull, I pull the sticker off, okay. Okay, so I got a cucumber, I got some celery, got a green apple. <clears throat> okay. Alright, well, those are the ingredients. Show them to you like that. So it's, uh, got one cucumber, got some celery, and a green apple. Showed you exactly what is in there. <clears throat> okay, and then I'm putting this down here so that way the pulp comes out into this container right here. So that's why I'm doing that. There's a plastic container here. So there's a reason why I'm doing that. Okay, alright, so I'll take the next step. Have a minute. Alright. <clears throat> yeah, sometimes it does get crazy around here, no joke. <clears throat> but yeah, it's important that I uh, keep my cool and, uh, you know, things get kind of crazy in the summertime when it gets super hot. But, uh, yeah, keep powering forward. Um, this is the plastic container that the juice is going in. I don't have that glass thing anymore, but that's fine. I can drink out of this. I just try to be resourceful and do the best I can with what I got, you know? So that's what I'm doing. Keep it as simple as possible. Okay. More parts is more complicated. Less parts. Make it as complicated or as easy as possible. Um, okay, give it a little. I'm gonna. I pray a little bit. Um, that kind of helps me to keep focus. Um, sometimes I do meditation and stuff. Me going to some places, doing a lot of prayer, um, and that helps. <clears throat> I've actually attracted quite a few things just from prayer, you'd be surprised. Um, not able to post all that stuff online, but pretty, uh, it's a pretty powerful tool. I've been able to acquire a few things just from that. It's been interesting, no doubt. Okay, let me get this one fired up. Um, start up with the celery and then grab the tamperator. and use this to press down on the vegetables and fruits. Actually, before I start juicing, I'm gonna slice this apple up because it can't go in there like that. See, it doesn't go in all the way. So uh, I'm gonna slice it first into pieces that will fit in there, as you've seen me do before. I'm just gonna do that again. So you can see, just use that, bam. Sort of slice it, even without a cutting board or whatever. I just make the most of it. <clears throat> so I splice right through that. Losing some water. It's not possible to be like 100% efficient all the time. There's always some kind of loss, you know. Okay, so I splice that. I'm going to slice it again.
I'm setting some of these pieces down here. Using some skills here. Okay, see? Just uh, break it off like that. That should probably fit in there and put it down there so I don't lose it. Um, do another slice. Bam. See another chunk of green apple right there. Okay, I'm going to do that again. Try to get all the, as much as I can from it. Just using skill. I've already cleaned my hands. Keep things sanitary. Okay. <clears throat> and so I got it sliced up pretty well. I just want to make sure I get every slice small to fit inside of the juicer first. So get it fired up. Okay, it's slicing right there. I'm going to pretty much see every step I'm taking during this process. <clears throat> so, slice right there. Go ahead and slice it again. Okay. Okay. Alright, so I got that sliced up. Um, as far as the cucumber goes, looks like it's going to have to be cut because it won't fit in there like that. So. So I'm going to grab it and uh, slice right through it. <clears throat> I'm doing this like in a really primitive type of fashion like, without cutting boards and stuff. Um, let's see if this fits. It looks like it'll probably fit. I'll try this one. Okay, so this piece doesn't seem like it's going to fit, so that's why I'm going to cut through the middle of it. So it's sort of like a, like a puzzle in a way. Okay. Just cut slice right through it, see, bam. Oh, whoopsie, I'm losing some juice, but that's fine. Okay. The stuff that uh, pickles are made of right here. <clears throat> okay, so I slice. So see these pieces of cucumber. <clears throat> see now looks like they'll fit. Let's see. Using uh, logic and skill together. Okay, so that looks like they'll fit. Okay. So I just solved the problem using my mind and my hand skill. Um now I'll do something with it. Alright? <clears throat> All right. All right. Let's get this baby started. I'm gonna turn the juicer on. Start with the celery, cucumber. All right. I'll demonstrate. I'll sh you know show and tell. Okay. All right. Uh, turn it on. Press up, rotates here. Rotate it clockwise. Okay, so I'm gonna start with celery. Put the, I'm gonna put all of it in there. Three celery. Okay, that's celery. Put a few, uh, this is really, for this type of juicer, celery is pretty easy to do. Stock just go, they fit right in, I don't even cut them up or anything like that. So it's coming out pretty good. I think it's just, you know, I don't think we need these just because of the, you know, the force of gravity that exists. Okay, huh. so I press down. More of it's coming out. The pulp's coming out. It's extracting the juice out of there. It's kind of fun doing this. Sometimes it's tough to have the time to make these videos, but you know, I really do enjoy it for real. It is uh, one of my passions. Sometimes I've gotten criticized over some of my habits, but whatever. I'm gonna keep doing my thing, you know. 
Don't worry. Alright. I think I'm gonna stay this the rest of this for tomorrow's juice or for the next juice recipe. That's part of the seller, it's like I don't know, five or six stems. I don't always count everything out exactly, you know. Press that down. See the bolt comes out. Okay, next I'm gonna add in the cucumber. Cucumbers are like 96% water, so a lot, a lot of juice comes out of that. So I'm gonna add in the whole cucumber. And you know, celery and cucumber would be sort of salty and watery. You know, the human body has actually a lot of it's actually blood plasma and salt and water. It's a pretty good uh, thirst quenching thing. Um, but I'm also adding in the apple to give it a little bit of sweetness. Um, so there goes the, there goes in the third section of cucumber that you saw me slice up. Just sort of let it go slow. Um, sometimes slower is actually better. Getting out the rush. A lot of things in the modern world are like extremely rushed. Sometimes it gets to be stressful. So I'm gonna throw in a little bit more there. And this is the apple, mining this in for sweetness. I'm gonna throw in a whole one. And let's see what's going on here. Okay, it's extracting it. And, uh, you know, because it's produce, it, it does tend to brown really quickly. See, it's already turning brown, like, almost immediately, which is why I try to get it in super, you know, I didn't think of the atmosphere, oxidation. Okay, slicing it for the pits, and then pressing it down. this on YouTube and thanks for watching let me know what you think it's gonna be good
coming up with juices, it's like, there's, different, there's a real art and science to it, you know? But it's a fun experiment and super hydrating. So, uh, let me know what you think. Post comments. Please subscribe to my videos. I'm going to put this one online. I'm going to charge my laptop and then, um, and head over to an area where Wi-Fi is available and then post it. Um, if there's enough power, <laughs> sometimes that's a limit to my ability to post these things. If you really want to know the truth. Um, so yeah. Alright, take care. Mitch Carrots on YouTube.com. Um, and keep these up as much as I can. It's like one of my favorite hobbies. Alright, 25 minutes. Take care. Peace. I'm going to enjoy my juice. Hope you get something to enjoy. I'm going to pray. I'm going to be grateful. My prayer is for peace. And I'm grateful to be alive. I'll leave you on that. Alright, take care now.